Hey everybody, so tonight I'm going to be doing something a little bit different than I've been doing lately. A um, very special person in my life uh, has asked me to do something uh, positive and non-political, which uh, she's been asking me this for quite some time, and uh, being that I've been talking about current events, it's very difficult to not be political and very difficult to be positive uh, with with the year that we've had. So putting all that aside, I'm, I'm put together something different tonight. Going to do something positive, light, pre 2020. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna get out of 2020 right now. No 2020, 2019. Okay, we're going to 2019. So in 2019, I got into art. So I've been drawing. Uh, unfortunately, I've kind of fallen off of it uh, this year, and uh, I'll, part of that is because of the podcast. I think I've really, uh, I, I really feel like I found my passion with with the podcast and the video blogging and everything. Uh, it's I I really feel like it's what I was always meant to do ever since I was a kid. It's what I've always been passionate about. But I also do really enjoy art, uh, painting, and drawing. So, I thought maybe maybe it'll help get me back into it if I share it with uh, some of the people that that are following me, and uh, maybe maybe I can get some ideas if anybody has uh, ideas for things that they might like to see me draw. Um, start off with just the ones that I like, the ones that I actually like, because this is supposed to be lighthearted and 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 funny or fun, fun for the viewer hopefully. Um, so I'm not a, I'm not a good artist, but show you my favorite ones first. So this is Darth Vader. Alright. And this is uh, Rose from Titanic. Alright. Uh, not safe for work. Not safe for work. And then I did a painting of Mufasa for the uh, in honor of the Lion King the live action that was released last year. I don't know. Could you call it live action? I, I don't no, it's it, CGI, right? Not, not cartoon, right? But I did the traditional, you know, original Mufasa, right? Original and best. So, like I said, uh, I'm gonna just kind of go through some of my my older drawings, you know, from my little book here, uh, kind of show the, the the progression of kind of where I started and where I got. Like I said, you know, nothing nothing political today, you know, just, just total, uh, just drawings, everything, right? All right, so. Um, let's see. This is uh, okay. It's a, I'm not gonna go through every single drawing, but um, just you know some of the favorites. You know. uh, there you go. We got got Anakin Skywalker, dark side Anakin. Did that with uh, just crayon, I think. Yeah, just crayon. Uh, let's see here. Another good one. Um, this is uh, Luna. Let's go, Luna. PBS Kids. Drew that for my kids. You know. Um, this uh, Heath Ledger Joker, yeah, I just didn't, not quite. Uh, this is at the beginning, okay. This is the beginning of the drawing pro, pro process, okay. So, okay. <laughs> wow, I haven't looked at these in a long time. Um, okay, you could probably guess who that is. All right, it's it's, it's rough. It's rough. Um, okay. This one right here, I challenge everybody. Comment, give me a comment who you think that is. I'm actually curious because my wife had, um, <laughs> I don't remember who she said, but I remember it was funny. It was a funny guess based on who it actually is. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold back from giving this one away and see if if anybody can can guess who this is. All right. Um, let's see here. Kind of jump around here. There's a, there's a lot of. You know, I'm not gonna go through every one. Um, let's see. Oh, here we go. Anybody anybody remember this movie? 1978, Pete's Dragon, Elliot the Dragon. Yeah. Um, okay, now these are good ones because see these are actually from I, I was taking an online course, so these are actually like lesson pictures. Um, Okay, and there's also a lot of like failed ones. Like here's a Mufasa fail. 
right? You know, it's just something, it's just proportionate wise. There's a lot of, that happens a lot in art. I'm learning myself. Um, okay, this one, this one I kind of like. This is the first drawing from the art, the online art course I was taking. The first assignment was to draw an eye following along with the instructor's guide, basically. And then when the when the uh, course is over, you draw another eye to compare where you started and where you're at. Uh, I started this course in I think June of 2019, and I have not finished it. I've got through like five lessons, I think. So yeah, that's what I mean. I, I've I've really I I'm very I'm kind of ADD when it comes to like forming habits. I'm uh, really really bad about it. It's hard for me to focus on one thing. But as I said, I really do have, uh, I feel passionate about the, the podcast. Um, used to do a lot of, like when I was a kid, um, even like middle school, high school age, I used to, uh, back, this is back when we had actual like cassette tape. Uh, and I would, I would actually record on the cassette tape recorder uh, and I would be the host and then I would do different voices and have people calling into the show. Um, so it's, yeah, it's always something that I want to do. That was a razor, unfinished. Looks like I never quite finished it, but it was a razor. Uh, there was some kind of uh, concept drawing, I guess, for a waterfall and a sunset. I don't know. Never never got around to finishing that one. You know, it happens. Um, okay, so this one. All right, so my wife, my wife uh, challenged me to draw Jack Skellington from uh, Nightmare Before Christmas without a reference. And I thought I could do it. Um, this is what I came up with. Um, so, you know. Wow. Wow. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna show this one really quick, all right? That's me sleeping, okay? So I'm for that one. Um, wow, okay. Okay, I can't, I can't show you this one. Can't show you this one. In fact, how am I gonna flip this so that it doesn't show? Okay, there we go. Can't show that one. Sorry. Uh, oh wow. Okay. Now this is a good example. <laughs> this is a good example of the <laughs> just the indicators of being a beginner. Because so what happened here was I just did a straight pencil drawing first. And I think it was all right when it was just the pencil drawing, but then I tried to color it in, and I basically just like bruised up his face. Like someone got some kryptonite and just beat the shit out of Superman. Um, so, <laughs> but I mean, as you know, I I thought this this you know got the he got the shadow to kind of like the the shading use of shading to sort of uh, give the illusion of like a, a strong chest. Um, and you got the tie collar here and the and the, the other side of the tie right here and flip it out as he's opening up his turn. You know, it's all right. Um, let's see. Oh, okay. Now these one now now okay, not good. All right. Don't get me wrong. Not good, but starting to get a little more respectable maybe. Okay, so here we got. Now you know who that is. Yeah, it's not baby Yoda. Not Baby Yoda, it's, it's Yoda. And then we got this one here. Okay, now this is comic book Superman. This is pretty good. Now the there's something going on with the leg here. Yeah, that like his leg is being like I don't know what's going on. Someone someone broke Superman's leg. It looks like that would hurt. That would hurt really bad. But he is Superman, so maybe he doesn't feel it. Um. Okay. Okay. Now here's another one. A, like a failed one. See, and I was trying to draw. I was trying trying to draw the Joker, the Tim Burton, Jack Nicholson Joker. It's ADD drawing, you know. It's like you gotta have focus. You gotta stay focused. You know? Sometimes I just didn't have the patience for it. So let's see. Okay, all right. Now this is this one I actually liked. Now here I was trying to do a like a concept poster for. For Batman, original Tim Burton Batman. Yeah, Michael Keaton there, and Jack Nicholson Joker there, you know. Um, 
Alright, I'm just gonna jump around here again. Okay, here's a really bad painting of uh, Mount Talic, Lake Tahoe. I actually, I did, so this is just like on paper. And this is, this is like really amateurish. But then I actually later, I started going and buying uh, canvases. So I actually, and I have several, I, I, I don't have them with me right now. But next time if I show my art again, I'll show some. I, did, I redid this one actually going there to, I don't know, to the mountain. And I, and I painted them. Good. I thought it was pretty good. So, anyway, here's another. Now, does anyone have a guess who that was going to be? That was going to be, I'll just say it since I already asked you to guess the other one. I don't want to confuse things too much. Uh, but this was going to be the mask. <laughs> Jim Carrey, you know, the mask. Um, and it just, well, I just wasn't feeling it. Sometimes, you know, you just don't feel it. That's why it's a sketchbook. That's why it's, you know. Um, all right, so here's this is a good one. I think this will be a good one to finish off because I, you know, it goes on. Well, actually, okay, I'm gonna show this because I like these two. I'm gonna show this one really quick, but first, all right. So this is Ray, right? Star Wars, yeah. Then the the latest trilogy, and then the last one I'll show because you know I'm kind of just getting kind of long, and I'm trying to just stay lighthearted, so I don't want to. I don't want to make it uh, depressing or anything, but it's Robert Williams, my favorite celebrity of all time. Rest in peace. Uh, it actually just was the anniversary of his death, just uh, I think yesterday. So I kind of like this one because you know it kind of captures his likeness. So anyway, uh, that's it. I think I think that's good for now. Uh, hey, it's Raphael, Ninja Turtles. So anyway. Um, so yeah, I just, I figured it was hard for me. I was trying to think like what, what is there, what is there lighthearted to talk about without, without getting too personal. Cause like I said it before, I, I don't like to share and I want to be careful about not sharing too much you know, personal stuff. So I was like, Hey, the art, you know, that might be, that might be cool. Um, I actually, I, so I started doing it because my, uh, my grandfather who passed away last year, uh, back east, so um, went back east, and um, I was with my grandmother at my grandmother's house, and the painting was up. Uh, and there was a painting on the wall, and it was painted by my uncle. Now, for people who are following along with these videos here, uh, my video a couple weeks back on uh, my uncle who um, committed suicide 15 years ago, um, it was his painting. It was a painting he did as, as in the forest. It was a really beautiful, really good painting. And actually, that painting inspired me to to get into art myself, and that's what that's what got me into this. So, so uh, you know, it's a good thing. Um, I think I think I think art is is um, good for me. I think that the I think the podcast and uh, you know uh, spoken word in general is a form of art. Uh, any any form of expression. So, you know, those are it. I, you know, if you guys have any comments, I'm always happy to hear uh, constructive feedback. Don't, don't, don't tear me apart too much. I, I kind of like this one. The kids like it. I, this is not, it's not traced, okay? Trust me, not traced. I know, I mean, I know, I know. It's like, you like, that's got to be traced, right? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, yeah, so that one. And then, actually, so James Earl Jones, right? We built James Earl Jones. All right, and then, of course, like I said, rose i like that one too classy classy those are the ones i got that i have up on my wall so yeah so anyway um let me know what you think so what i would i i really love the the engagement that i've got going on with with uh you know the, the people some of the people that have been leaving comments lately i really love it i love being able to reach out to people and uh i just sharing just sharing our experiences and our perspectives on things so um, if you have any any thoughts on like something that you'd like to see me try to draw, because one of the for me one of the hardest parts about drawing is actually picking something to draw. And with my scattered brain, like I was showing all those pictures in here where like I start drawing it and I don't finish it. Um, so yeah, if anybody has a challenge for me that you think I should try to draw, uh, let me know in the comments. And then also give me your guess 
for the mystery for the mystery drawer. Um, should I? I you know what you got. You can rewind, right? You just scroll back to where the picture is if you want to look at it again. I was going to try to find it, but it's going to, it's somewhere in here, you know? It's going to take me a while. So anyway, you know, like I said, um, I, I, I like this. I think this is a good idea. I think it was, I think it was kind of cool to just like, you know, to just do something like not political, um, anything like that, just kind of lighthearted. And uh, so, yeah, thanks for, thanks for uh, staying with me all this time. I hope you hope you enjoyed my pictures. Uh, good Lord, wow, 15 minutes. I, if you have made it this far, I am really appreciative. That is awesome. Um, I hope that if you have made it this far, that it has not been a, um, <laughs> has not been in vain. I hope that you're not regretting that and thinking that I don't ever want to see this guy again. Um, I hope that it, I hope that it's brought you uh, a moment of of. Uh, relief or at least uh, a break a pause from the uh, from the mayhem that's going on right now um, and uh, I feel good you know it was kind of, it was actually kind of nice to not mention anything besides just this so again thank you very much for staying with me all this time uh, drop me those guesses and uh, I'll be talking to you again really soon Remember, don't be afraid to question the consensus.